this place a little bit even though I'm sunburnt on my legs and it hurts a little bit to walk and all that I'm going to start off by saying way there in the distance if you can see that canopy right down there in between the trees not the one that looks like the umbrella but the other one that's where my father's parked at the moment my mother and grandmother are out oh god Urgh, sliding glass doors hard to open um they're out shopping anyway this is what I can wake up to and look out each day and night. I want there's koi pond down, <clears throat> expansive koi pond down below. Uh, more barbecues this way. Lots of pool cabana. A uh, little pool umbrella. As long as I stay under the things that look like wooden bushy umbrellas or any of these lounge chairs that are out here in the sun. I'm cool. I can't put any of my stuff on the second floor here. And there's like one other spot I'm not allowed to put my stuff when you go to the pool. Anyway, there's the pool thing a thing where you pick up your towels and other such stuff in the distance. And here's the pool. Oops. Yeah, actually, well, that's the when the, at night that turns red, so that kind of looks like a volcano. But here's the pool. One of them. This big massive structure here. That's a kid's splash thing in the back. Uh, yeah, with all the little fountains and things. And deepest this thing gets is like four and a half feet, which is right there. Let's see if I can, yeah, right there, four and a half feet. There's another spot, play in a beach spot, and a water slide. Let's see if I can show you. Yep, and more of this pool, a couple of spots to lay in. You know, if we're in the water, when you got your chair, one there. There's another jacuzzi that's blue at night. The rest of this pool is white because of the pool lights. And it's heated too. The pool itself is heated. Not as hot as the two jacuzzis. Although the one that's, um, the one that's the, uh, uh, oh my God. The one that's, I said there was a volcano is hotter than that one right there. And that's the pool bar where you can order food or drinks and sit down and eat or you can take it out. Or you can, I guess, order takeout and have it delivered to you somewhere around the pool if you're easy to spot. Um, you can also charge it to the room if you so choose. Down there is a fire pit they light at night. And, of course, they light up all kinds of tiki torches all over the place at night. Over there is another thing that was going to be a big pool. Um, I'll tell you more about that shortly. But that's that. Here's our balcony thing. And I'm on my way to drop off some postcards, so we're going to go do that. I do. There's our living room. There's a bed under there if you like. There's a big TV with, I haven't tried actually watching anything on it yet. We haven't actually this entire trip so far. Um, here's a, one of the master bedrooms. You got your own TV here. Got this thing, a closet thing, a nice view out that way. Ceiling fan, yeah. Of course, big master shower, master bath, master, basically it's the main one and you can even shut that sliding door thingamajig. Um, lots of buttons in this place too. Here's the kitchen thing with all kinds of lighting and other lights and walk-in pantry and a microwave and a freaking thing of thing. There's no oven though. Oh yeah, there is, I'm sorry. My mistake, toaster, walk-in pantry, which is really cool. <coughs> oh, come on. God, this is probably going to take up most of my memory, but that's okay. <laughs> I'm not worried. Over that, Let's see if I can back up a little bit. There's that. Here we go with the stuff over here, another bathroom. 
another shower, laundry room where you can wash your shit, wash your stuff. Yeah. Of course, another bathroom, another bedroom. It's got its own TV, another closet thingy, and another cool view. So let's go. Let's go down to the front lobby and drop off some postcards. I gotta come back up here anyway. But I figure while I'm down there, I'll take this video might be two parts because I gotta take a second to speak to the front desk. I got some postcards for work that I want to send out. God, I should mention not only did I get my feet sunburnt. Oh, that's the cool pool floaty I picked up at ABC store. Saw somebody with one and I went, I want one. And I'm like, where'd you get it? And they go, where'd you get it? Huh? ABC store. Okay. So, out my door we go. We're on the top floor. But yeah, as I was saying, I went snorkeling the other day. Not only did I manage to successfully burn my the backs of my legs, which hurt when I walk a little bit, hurt when I stand. I also managed to, um, to, um, 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 um scrape my feet along some coral, which I wish I'd been wearing an aqua sock. The aqua sock would have taken the hit for that. So as you can see, I've got some a bandage and some tape on. The tape's gonna stay probably when I get to the pool in a little bit, but the bandage, not so much. So, down here, freaking elevators, they're supposedly very fast and very quiet. Fast, yes, quiet, probably not. There's no info on them or I'd there we go, or I'd let you see them. There we go, that's an indicator. Let's get in. Check this out. That, and a TV in your elevator too. So we want a lobby. If anybody knows what that noise was, tell me. So, <clears throat> when I get nearest the lobby and we stop the video and we talk to the front desk about sending some postcards to my co-workers at work. Just more of that cool stuff. A lot of people at work this morning, I guess. Here's the Koi Pond, which is cool. Got all kinds of, let's see if we can see any fish real quick. Yeah, plenty of fish. They all seem to come towards me, like, isn't that weird? I just step out here. Oh, probably because of the bigger fish, <laughs> the bigger koi fish coming this way. But they seem to all come near me, you know? Look at that, isn't that weird? Such pretty koi fish, though. <laughs> It's a big expansive pond. Even goes under a bridge out there. Anyway, the other night I almost walked into this because I didn't see the pond because it's just dark when, it, when you walk this way. Thank God the, the, the light from some of those tiki torches, I think it was specifically that one. It was having its reflection across the pool. I went, oh, shit. the koi pond. And I made an immediate, immediate left. Anyway, the big expansive lobby. This place is awesome. Okay, so now here's where I gotta pause the video and speak to somebody. I don't know what that is. Huh. Must have something on there. Anyway. Alright. I'll pause for a minute. You'll see me in a second, but out there is where you can pick up and drop off your car or leave and enter if you're, you know, checking in and so forth. Anyway, uh, waiting a couple of seconds. So it's even, Stevens. That was easy. <coughs> so now we're gonna go. I don't know how much sun my legs can handle because they don't have aloe on them or sunscreen yet. 
I was letting my stuff dry a little bit because I fell asleep last night before I could, uh, before I could uh, get dressed, or excuse me, before I could take my clothes out of the shower. So let's go this way. Message keeps on popping up. There's, I don't know what this place is, but it's always showing this on the screen, which is really cool. Whatever it is, it's really cool. Again, I don't know what this room is, so don't ask me. Shave ice, which is very strong. It's very strong shave ice. It's, um, it's, uh, like twice the flavor and twice as less the ice. But there's some little shops down here that you can do. You can get yourself a picture. Of course, us, it's pictures with the parrots. And there's the pool bar. If you guys want to read, you can pause the screen. But that's basically it. You can... Well, I'll show you guys all this in a second. But, yeah. This place is nice. Kids club. Concierge, if you want to pester them about anything. This restaurant is closed, but, so we're gonna go this way. A couple of bathrooms, I guess. The bathrooms all over this place. We're gonna go this way. This is a store, 6.30 a.m. to 8 p.m. They got snacks and pool stuff and all kinds of other knick-knack, bric a brac Maybe I'll walk back through the whole way out. This way, this was supposed to be, uh, here I'm zooming in now, was supposed to be a big pool, but some, my dad said they changed their mind and installed a plunge pool, 10 feet by 12 feet, right there and right there. Which, actually, I think it should have been a big pool. Maybe not heated, but... Because, you know, you got to have a spot to dip your... And here comes Bernie. Bernie time because my legs are going to get in the sun. It's okay, I'm not planning to stay out here long. There's some more barbecues. Got to turn the timer on underneath. It should be right there. That little box thing. And then flip your knobs and set your uh, stuff. And uh, away you go. There's the... There's the shut off with some... Actually, more bathrooms back that way. And here's the pool place. Close. I'm gonna go under the pool bar because it's freaking gonna burn the lake. Check. Yeah. That's better. I can't go any further because I don't need damn sunscreen. That's basically it. This big, massive expanse of thing is heated. The jacuzzis are heated even more, but the pool is heated like... My dad said yesterday, 85 and a half degrees. Which is great! And even the ocean's warm too. Which... <coughs> I'll show you on the footpath upstairs again how to get there, but... Anyway... Here's the pool bar. A new pool bar, excuse me. And in the distance, a couple of islands. And uh, that way behind the place. And, oh yeah, I'm thinking about ordering something from here for lunch today. And charging it to the room just once, just to say I did it. And you'll take out that way. If you go sit down, they bring it to you. And I might, I might actually eat something before I go in the water, maybe. Because once I'm in the water, I'm not gonna kind of want to come out. It's too nice. But let's go this way. Some drinking fountains. One of which I think is for your water bottle as well. Not that I drink water while I'm here. I mostly guzzle down soda like I do at home. Big expansive place. Expensive place, all kinds of goodies. Your... It's you. <laughs> okay, stay. All kinds of pool, whatnot. If you want to fling things or 
throw things or chase things, floating things. Of course, as I said, I got mine from, um, what you call it, ABC stores, so. This place is awesome. There's band-aids. Are there band-aids down here? Oh, maybe not. I don't know, maybe not. Anyway, more cool stuff you can get. All kinds of knick-knack, bric-a-brac. And actually, oh, hello. Oh my God. I'm, I might have to pause this video. I might get myself a couple of building blocks. Can you? Oh shit, who's got the special card though? Crap. Because I see a volcano and I would like these things. And we're getting these for the family. I like the volcano and I like the car and the Hawaii location. I'm going to have to come back this way. I should have paid more attention. They didn't have the octopus though. Which I got my uncle the octopus and the other thing. Open sesame. <laughs> I wonder if that was management. Anyway, once I go back upstairs, it's gonna be time for me to pretty much get my stuff on head to the pool, maybe. But I'm gonna ask my mother where she left the discount card. Because I might pick up three of those for myself. Walking with the car in the uh, Hawaii. Looks pretty cool. Anyway, <coughs> I know you're seeing this twice. But that's because I'm showing you the reverse of how to how to get up from the pool to your room. But more guests. This place is awesome. And here's the bonus of it. My, I'm not sure how to describe this, but my family, specifically my parents, bought into this place. Um, it's not a timeshare. They own a deed or something like that, but they bought into this place for life. So you pay, they pay a homeowner's fee every year. Um, and then they pay a small fee each night they stay here, but they can stay here for a week, once a year. And that's great. So that means when they die, I get this place. And I'm excited because this place is fancy and awesome. I think I know what I'm going to do, too. Just got to figure out where the discount card is. I met our neighbors last night coming up in the elevator. They seem fairly nice. Oh, shit. Oh, you got to be kidding me. I locked myself out of the room. Oh, that fucking sucks. Oh, I'm so stupid. Now I have to go back down and get the key from dad anyway. Oh, crap. Oh, well. I hope dad has a room key or, or, or I'm screwed. <laughs> well, I'm stopping.